What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD Visually Blind in Hero Mode. And in this episode, we're going to be finishing up exploring the rest of the world map that I haven't explored yet. Ooh, how very mysterious. So last episode, we made it to the Angular Islands. I think that's what this is called, right? What a weird name. Right, the Angular Islands. I, I guess just because if you look at the map... I mean, the other island is at an angle to this. I don't freak out. That's kind of a stupid <laughs> reason to me, but whatever. Um, okay, that was weird. Um, we're going to finish up exploring this. And I guess we're going to just go continue to explore the rest of the map and, yeah, finish up here. So, yeah, we're on this really, like, memorable island to me. What is this? Is this just a heart piece? That's really stupidly easy if this is just a heart piece. Hmm. That stupid blue chew. You got a piece of heart, Cliff. What is this? Complete a new heart container. Heart containers equals mirror life and stuff. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Okay, I want to climb up here, preferably. You know what? I could just get up with my hook shot, to be honest. I kind of don't want to do that because that's a little too easy. I'm sure, he's the one going. It's going the wrong way. But you know what? Screw it. We could. We could sacrifice um, some bit of magic here. I don't feel like changing the wind direction, so screw it. Go, Swiggles! <laughs> okay, maybe it's going a bit slower than I thought it would, but that's okay. Uh, we're still going to make it. Right, right into the hole we go! <laughs> that's awesome. I didn't even release my leaf there. Just because I went into the hole. Oh, this place! I thought... Okay, I remember this cave. But I remember this just being a typical... Um, Thing where you fight a bunch of monsters, but obviously I'm wrong. But I do remember this now that I look at it. So I guess our first goal is to get to the top here, and then do something with the beams laid. I'm actually not sure what we're going to be doing with that. That'll probably become apparent once we get up there, though. So I'm not really too worried about that, to be fair. Um, what if we move that out again? Because okay, that, that works. And then, ooh, but we, oh, well, I guess that worked, actually, because, yeah, I was going to say, that pulls that down. Okay, so we can't move it out again, though. All right, yeah, that works. All right, we're up here. That was a significantly easy puzzle. <laughs> Didn't expect it to be that easy. It's so weird, like, seeing these, like, that should definitely be falling, right? Oh, let's face it. Come on. Is this seriously it? That's kind of ridiculously easy, but okay. Um, hmm. Is that really all it's... That just looks like monster loot. Is there more chests in these mouths? What am I missing? I... Uh -oh. oh, I went through the tooth. Okay, great. Looks like we can even go in there. You got silver rupee! Really? That's it? Where's this lead? Huh. I wonder if there's anything in the other mouth. Does this just lead to the same one? No! Cool, they're all like connected to each other. That's weird. So we just keep going in and out, it just leads us in circles. <laughs> That's so weird to me. But it's actually really cool too. Oh, but it resets the puzzle. Is there anything here? No, uh oh. Uh oh, my control stick just got stuck. From one the time I threw, I don't know if you guys watched a few episodes ago where I was talking about how I got really mad playing Smash Bros with my friend, I threw my controller. I never did finish explaining that, did I? See, I'm used to the GameCube controllers playing Smash Bros and getting mad and like bashing them and then never having like a consequence for it. <laughs> okay, I'm facing the right way. First Haven's over there. Alright, we I want you to be gone now. No, I want you to be gone now. <laughs> we did Okay, we did okay. I wanted to make absolutely sure I talked on the map fish there. I was pretty certain we did. But I don't wanna make a mistake. Miss Tacchio. Not that on there, is it? It's not that, but it looks like there's this mini island over here. Platforms. Let's make sure there's no more platforms here. Um, okay, there's no more Triforce pieces. We have to remember. There's no more Octos, yes? Correct. Light rings, I don't care at all about. Okay, the last platform. Did we deal with the platform in the last square? I don't think we did, did we? What was the last square before this? Dang it. Oh, it's 2i Reef, right? Yeah, so we definitely did deal with it there. Okay, great. Phew. Huh. A little bit scary there. Okay, so the only other... Oh, I know what island this is. I've been waiting for this island. The only island with platforms left is the last one. So, woo! Oh, 
Oh man, a fish or a bottle. What do I want? Well, considering probably people don't care about the stupid bottles. Let's go to our item screen here. What? No, stop! Stop being a butt game. Stop doing what I don't want you to do when doing things I want you to do, silly. So this island is pretty memorable to me as well. And I'm not gonna spoil it as quite a if you look at the top right there, it looks like there's someone standing there. Holy small fry! So unfortunately, we're not going to be able to see many games from here since this is a money-making island. That is called <gasps> the Boating Course! Yay! Which is weird because this island looks like a tiny little baby. So it's like, how can a um, Boating Course go to be? Let me ask you something, fra. Have you ever been? Have you been using ZR to make your boat jump? Well, have you? Of course, going out of the sea, just jump around and be real dumb if you ask me. Anyway, if you tilt it, if you tilt, blah 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 blah. Do you move your tiller just as you land? That's how you make sure. Really? If you didn't know that one, try to. I forgot about that. That's really cool. With that, I'm off. Let's try that out. So if you jump, then eh. That's cool. Wow, that's really awesome. I think I did. I think I do actually remember Chuck Conroy talking about that, but I don't remember. I didn't remember it till now. It didn't remind me of it till now. Oh, it looks so grand, doesn't it? This island that is. It's gonna be in here. Oh my good lord, I'm so excited, you guys. You got the Sea Hearts chart. Now you know where charts showing piece of heart locations are hidden. Ooh, so another special chart. Because it's a special chart, you could bet your bum hole that uh, we got it from. Oh, there it was right there. You could bet your butthole that we actually got it uh, from dealing with the Sea Reef. Oh, okay. So these are treasure charts that would lead you to heart pieces. So it seems we've dealt with all the treasure charts. Well, we've gotten all the treasure charts that will lead us to heart pieces anyways. So you can even see on the right there that you get the treasure chart, then you pull up the box, and then it gives you a heart. Cool. Alright, so pretty useless for me, because I have all a bunch of notes written down. Um, it's not where I want it to. Yeah, there's a guy standing on here. Hello, dude. I'm wondering what the heck I'm doing. No, stop. Just stop. All right, get out. <laughs> as great as that sail is, it is freaking annoying as balls trying to stop with it. Okay, if I remember correctly. No? Okay, I thought this is where the blue tree was. Apparently I'm wrong because I'm a stoop. Do I have... Did I drink granny, granny soup? I guess I did. I don't even remember. Well, I guess I do remember filling up before I leave me outside island. But I thought I got hit by now. Yeah, full strength to me. There's a bunch of barrels here that no doubt has some supplies for living. Let's destroy them. Which is an easier way to destroy barrels. Destroy people's livelihood. Oh, great. You made two rupees. Good job, dude. Hey, that's a pretty sick boat you got there, kiddo. So what do you say, kiddo? You want to play a boating game for 30 rupees? What do you say? Yeah, sure. Alrighty then. Then go down the start line. Once again, this is actually a money-making game, so yeah, four minutes, make as many poopies as you can. Hey, I'm glad they gave us a counter. Oh, uh, they don't even let you um, use your sail here. So I guess the wind automatically changes with you. Maybe it changes based on time. Let's see how big of a combo we get going here. I don't think it's possible to get everything. Well, maybe it is. This course even isn't even really that big. <laughs> I mean, you could definitely make your money back. Oh, 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 okay, I was going to say, you know what? I bet you make a bunch of bonus rupees depending on how quickly you beat this course. I bet that's how this works. Otherwise, what would be the point, right? Uh-oh. No, come on, come on, seriously. Come on. Oh, I have to get it. I have to. You guys know, I, you guys know me. I, you know I have to do it. Come on, jeez. Oh, man. Uh, yeah. Okay, great. I did it. So happy with myself. No! Why is this so stupid? This is not hard. Not hard, man. It's not hard. Shouldn't be hard. Eh. Oh, whatever. Just leave it. I don't care anymore. It's stupid. I hate it. What? I pressed the jump button! 
Come on, this is not a hardcore. This is cringy. This is like freaking watching Game Gums play freaking Mario 64 or Wind Waker. This is dumb. This is not. This is not how this should be going. I see an exploding barrel over there. Don't even try to trick me. Yeah, yeah. How come you didn't like till now, freaking butthead? I bet it's that guy on the island trying to blow me up. What a pee pee. <laughs> what a stupid idiot head. That's all I got. All right, whatever. I'll freaking beat your course. All right, you only missed 10 poopies. Whoa, whoa, where do we go? Oh, we go this way. I thought that was the end there. Apparently not. Apparently it's longer than it looks. Look, there's a bunch of cigals. I didn't know any better. I guess that there was a freaking big octo here. Wouldn't that be hilarious? A big octo invaded this course. Oh, we gotta do the long jump. Ah! And I kind of went through the barrel there, but whatevs. Whatevs. All right. Now I'm kind of regretting not going back for that rupee because we've seriously gone everything else so far. I guess the maximum amount of- I, I bet he's gonna give you bonus rupees here for defeating it in X amount of time. Right, you beat it in less than four minutes! Congratulations! Here's an extra ten rupees! If you beat it in under three minutes, I'll give you an extra thirty rupees. This clear little cutscene. Rupees one, one forty. Time remaining, one thirty. So, I mean, if you're desperate for rupees, I guess you could do that. Oh, way to be! Alrighty then, here's 140 rupees. As you collected, as promised. They're all yours. Enjoy, kiddo. Looks like you made a fortune. Come back and do it again sometime. I guess it doesn't matter then. So this guy we've actually seen before. He comes to Outside Island occasionally, and he chills out there in the in the cafe during the nighttime, which is weird, considering um, considering that like he was here during the night just now. But if we went to Windfall, he would totally be there too. <laughs> oh, you know what? Actually, I don't think we use our deck leaf to go across here. I bet we use this. So let's pull our deck leaf just in case. Better safe than sorry or something. Oh. No, nope. alrighty then. Hmm, maybe we have to jump from here. I feel like that's why this rock exists. Hey, look, it's a bottle. I'm not gonna get it. Too out of my way. I'm too lazy. Dude, come on, leg! Ah! I think you got a special chart in here. Um, I don't remember what it is. That's why I'm kind of specifically telling you guys. You got a special chart here. Ooh, one of these, eh? Oh no, I know what this is. I'm gonna be freaking trolling me with Denez until I get all the goddamn switches great. Ooh, freaking wonderful. Ah! First, I gotta freaking switch my arrows out. Look, I had a good chance there. Nope. No, come on, dude! Are you got? How did I miss twice? I have a. Got you! So obnoxious. We'll kill you. Oh, there we go. It better not be timer based. Oh, that would be so infuriating. If it's like, well, you got all the switches. You didn't get. Oh, you didn't get them all in ten seconds. Yes, got it. Right. Concentrate. Yeah. Phew. Jeez. That only lasted a few seconds, but that was still really freaking obnoxious. All right, now I think these guys stopped spawning. After I activate all the switches. Hmm. This is just gonna give me a treasure chest that leads. Oh no! You got a submarine chart! Now you know where to find the enemy submarines that surface from below. Alright, so when it says enemy submarines, you might be wanting. What enemy submarines? Whoa, dude, calm down here, Mr. Stupid Nene. Stupid Nene. Um, yeah, just, it's pretty obvious. It's just the submarines that we've been traveling to, and I've been having, I've been knowing where they are. Whoa, there's one more? Wait a minute. There's also one on that island. What island? That's not outset, that's head. Did we take care of it? I really hope we took care of it, because I don't remember. I mean, I know we didn't take care of it this time, but I might have seen it going to head so island. I'm like, oh, I should go there. Hmm. It's gonna bother me. Anyways, yep, that's the summary. Wait, it's the last. It's the last one, right? Okay. Wow, this is. Wow, we're so close to finishing exploring, you guys. It's crazy. Okay, we did get the map fish for this square, right? Yes. Yeah, because this is where he told me I could do sharp turns. Was I in the right way? I'm not. We need to go this way to the very last island. I have no idea what this is. That should be a very boring island. End my journey in a very boring, relaxing manner. Alright, there is a platform here, so let's take a look out for it. There's the forsaken woods and crap there. Oh yeah, that's another thing I gotta do. I gotta do the, 
the I gotta save all the forest trees and crap. And crap. Oh, there's a the platform. Mm, that's that something is gonna bother me. I'm gonna have to totally go take a look and make sure I didn't miss anything there. I feel ah. I mean, I definitely didn't go there in this recording session. I mean, that's a Headstone Island, though. That's one of the temples. Mm, that really bugs me. All right. Let's crawl up, crawl up, and go down. Maybe I'll just kind of leave it off to the side and be like, eh, if I'm missing something, I'll know where to go look. I don't know, though. <laughs> I might totally just need to go look and just, like, be like, if there's nothing there, I'll just cut the episode here. Or some crap. Hello, assholes! There better be something here for me. Ooh, what is an island off in the distance? Looks like there's a bunch of islands. I actually have no bloody idea, mate. Wait, I guess we'll pull out a bomb and start taking care of the uh, cannons. There's a cannon, right? Yes, there is. Cannon? Cannondorf! You know what? These big pots kind of show me where the big cannons are, aren't they? Has that been a thing all along? It might, be, it might have been a thing all along. This might have been stupid and missed it every single time. Well, I thought it was going to be a treasure chart for a second. I was like, really? That's weird. Hey, asshole. Oh, that's interesting. We only had to destroy the cannons there to get this to spawn instead of kill everything on the platform. You got gun feather. Who cares? <laughs> oh, man. All right. Freaking back to the bomb. Wee, because we're bad. Oh, that was amazing if I landed in my ship. Wow. I'm too cool for school. You're never too cool for me. Too school for cool you guys see you could tell I dropped out of school because I said too school for cool. I'm just kidding, I didn't drop out. Well, I guess I can I dropped out of university. Oh really? One of these places? Are you serious? Come on. Alright, so yeah, I can see what the hero charm does. I guess we're gonna Oh yeah, there, there's cannons here. Like what is what is throwing at me? I don't freaking know. Ah, oh, like went through his freaking tail feathers and everything. All right, let's go. Play. Did I get it? Holy crap! I can't believe I got that. Fine. Ah, oh, I swam right, or I freaking sailed my ship right into that. What a bad sea captain I am. Well, I mean, I'm taking damage, but at least I'm killing all these assholes. So maybe I am a good sea captain. It's so stupid seeing the rupees fly at you. There we go. Hey, right, Mapfish. Where the balls are you? Do I have all my sea charts open? Because I don't see a beam of light here. That's a bit worrying. Hmm. They're all open. Wait. What? Okay, there wasn't one at the end there. I mean, heck, I definitely haven't been here, so... Yep, I totally have not been here. Alright, let's go to our items. Let's actually try this out again. Let's pull out our hook shot. Oops. See if it immediately stops me. It does! That's really awesome. And kind of stupid, but really awesome. I guess I'll use a hoi pair too to check out and see if there's anything on top of these puffers. I don't think there is. We'll take a look. The last manfish. Mish. Mishman. <laughs> the last Mishman. The last Michelin man. Five star isles. I think there's like three of these places in this world, wasn't there? Have you seen it, small fry? The ghost ship? Because it's real. It's even been seen here in these very waters. On nights where the crescent moon faces down, that's where the horror rises. It's so scary. <laughs> and the way he says it there, I think that was like that scariest text there, too. Because he says it so ominously, you know? I know there's a freaking. Where is it? There's a submarine somewhere in the square. I know there is. I have the freaking map. And it tells me so. The tingle bottle, that's not what I want. I don't think there's any seagulls here even, but you know what, let's try it out. A whole pair. There is. So yeah, uh, I have even had any instances of it yet, but if there's no seagulls in an area, it will like tell you, like you'll put it on your head and you'll just stand there and a line of text will come said, say, or says something like nothing happens or something like that. Do you see a submarine from up here? Wait, they're not. Alright. Nothing. 
All right, didn't think so, but figured it'd be worth a try. Also, I wonder if the ghost ship will appear here, because that'd be really convenient if he did. There's like a, what, one six chance of it appearing? Since there's six phases of the moon in this game. Hmm. How does this... We can't, like, zoom in on this map, can we? I mean, the... Not the platform, the submarine chart. Yeah, apparently there's a submarine here somewhere. Is it that over there? Definitely night time now. I ain't slaying no ghost ship. I ain't afraid of no ghost ships. Ah, oh, it is up there. Okay. Crescent moon. Crescent moon. Crescent moon. That is not a crescent moon. <laughs> okay. Just stay there for a second. Oh, I bet. Hope I didn't disorientate myself and not be able to find the submarine. Since, you know, that'd be just my luck. I think I am going to go take a look at the other submarine. You know what? Screw you guys. I'm not going to fight you. There's no point. I know I'm supposed to vanquish evil and all that, but screw it. Guys could just live your lives, your boring lives out here doing absolutely nothing. Look at those adorable bats. Hold on a second. I don't think I've ever seen the bats just kind of chilling up there like that before. I'm going to normally just pink batty. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, look, he's, even, he's having little batty dreams. He has a big smile on his face. Oh, I don't even want to kill him. Sorry. You have no idea how close to death you are. I'm sorry. <laughs> I actually feel bad. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I didn't realize, but I guess the only time you ever see the, uh... Oh, these guys don't have bad dreams anymore. The only time you see how much life an, an enemy has when you walk on it, which is kind of lame in my opinion, but whatever. I mean, it should just have bars all over the freaking screen. That'd be cool. <laughs> and it should be, like, an option to turn that off, though. You know, sometimes you see. Oh, you don't even have to kill the bats. That's kind of weird. It's not like they're hard to summon. It's like, you know, you should be able to push a button or something that causes the uh, bars to turn off if you don't like them. Or maybe not even turn off. Whoa, do I have to, like. Oh, okay. I was going to say. I don't have to bring, like, a wooden stick up here or anything, do I? But yeah, there should be, like, a button to turn off. Like, all the bars on the screen show you all the health of the enemies. Just change it to one if, like, you know, it becomes too much. You got a piece of heart, like the toll too. Hmm, so exploring all the islands, we still have um, six pieces of heart left. Here. Holy crap, that's actually more than I thought it would be. I thought we'd at least be on 19 hearts. Maybe like be on 19 and like a half heart or something like that. Alright, whatever, we're done here. Okay, so that's it, you guys. We've explored every single square in this game at this point. That's crazy. If you watch all these episodes, you're freaking crazy. We did not get where I know there's gotta be there's gotta be a beam of light. I got 47 treasure shards. I got all the treasure shards in the game, man. Don't lie to me. Please just tell me it's not rendering in. What the heck? Why? What's going on? Game Game I'm so confused. Like, this is 7x7, seven seven, right? Hold on a second. I'm going to try and figure this out. What is 7x7? Seven seven? Here's some information. What is 7 multiplied by 7? Looking. The answer is 49. Haha! <laughs> I'm stupid. It's 49. Wait. I'm even more confused. We have three Triforce charts. That adds up to 50. What? Huh? There's, there's, no, there's no squares where there's both a treasure chart treasure and a Triforce shard. Unless the Triforce shards count as... Treasure charts, they might, I guess. Actually, that's probably what it is, isn't it? Hmm. Let's take a look here. Well, there's 46, so that's not true. Because treasure, like, there's a number one treasure chart, and there's a number one Triforce chart. I'm really confused, you guys. Right? Yeah, treasure chart one, two, and three, and then it goes to Triforce charts. I'm going to have to look into this. I mean, at least it'll be easy to narrow down which treasure charts I'm missing based on, like, which squares I'm missing. 
Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna teleport uh, back to Headstone Island here. And I'm gonna meet you guys there, and then we're gonna go take a look at the submarine and make sure I didn't miss anything in there. So I'll see you guys in a uno momento. Actually, if the episode ends off right here, uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and say that we did the submarine and there's no point in showing it, so I will be right back. Or maybe see you guys later and thanks so much for watching. If you would like, feel free to subscribe and like the video if you haven't already. Blah 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 blah. Bye bye. Maybe question mark. Oh, I see the submarine. Hmm, this is pretty close to you, and I feel like this would have been hard to miss. And then again, I might have purposely missed it, so I'd be like, well, at least I don't want to get confused over what submarines I've done and which ones I haven't. I don't know if I've done this one or not. Holy crap, there's a lot of dudes! I mean, I kind of vaguely remember this, but there might be submarines. Holy crap, that's crazy. Holy crap, a lot of rupees! I don't remember being this many rats. I feel like we haven't done this. Wow, wow, these guys are red! Those are different rats. They have long tails, too. Long dick. Wow, that rat toy just went through the... Oh, he didn't go through the wall. He went to his mouse hole. It's a little rat tack hole. Yeah, yeah, do all the damage you want to me. I don't care. Why not curve? Die! Oh, look, there's fire down here. Okay, we definitely didn't do this one, then. Alright, you know what? Screw you. I'm not dealing with your crap. <laughs> we killed him! We killed him! I can't believe we missed a treasure chart. That is really stupid of me. Alright, well, I guess I did end up showing this then, because, yeah, we definitely didn't do this. Let's go up here, collect this stupid treasure chart, and call an episode there. And you know, it's kinda, I'm kind of hoping this is the, the five-star place we were just at that there was no treasure for and I was really confused I thought I had all the treasure charts but apparently not because I'm stupid all right let's see what we have in this chest we got treasure <laughs> all right let's quickly take a look at what this freaking gosh dog diggity is um I feel like it's gonna be over here no well this is a good start <laughs> all right um Oh, oh man, I even paused on there and I still. Oh, nope, that's the God's Tower. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching for real this time. Like you already said the end. I already said the intro, so we're gonna have to listen to it again. Alright, talk to you guys later. Bye bye!